it's just been a year since ChatGPT first came out, which has just been astounding. Recently, there has been a rise in technologies that bridge the gap between various data modalities and languages as a result of the convergence of AI developments and multimodal data. The Any Modality Augmented Language Model, developed by FAIR, Meta, and Meta Reality Labs, is called AnyMail. AnyMail, a new AI model from Meta, is a multimodal genius that is incredibly versatile and effective. It excels at tasks like image captioning, text-to-speech synthesis, video summarization, and conversational question answering because it understands and generates text from a variety of inputs better than other models. The model is composed of three components, a pre-trained aligner module, a multimodal instruction set, and a LLM backbone. These components enable the model to convert multiple modalities to text and carry out various tasks, such as image captioning and text-to-speech synthesis. Being the first multimodal model with an Elama 2-based LLM backbone that can handle reasoning and text answer generation, AnyMail has the disadvantage of using different encoder-decoder setups for each form of response. It is a multimodal AI that excels in understanding and producing language from a variety of inputs, outperforming GPT-4 in flexibility, adaptability, and control. By producing precise and contextually appropriate responses based on a combination of text and picture inputs, AnyMail, Meta's new multimodal genius, outperforms previous models and in tasks including image captioning, text-to-speech synthesis, video summarization, and conversational question answering. It excelled above competing models in text-to-speech synthesis and image captioning, garnering high marks from human judges for coherence, diversity, informativeness, relevance, and naturalness. The ability of artificial intelligence to comprehend and produce human language has advanced significantly. When it comes to processing and reacting to multiple sensory inputs, standard language models frequently fall short. An innovative multimodal language model called AnyMail was created by a team of researchers in response to this constraint. It can comprehend and produce language in conjunction with visual, audio, and motion information. AnyMail allows users to engage with the model by utilizing sensory cues from their surroundings, going beyond text-based inputs and outputs. Queries that depend on a shared understanding of the environment through sensory impressions are made possible by this multimodal method. AnyMail can absorb and produce language with ease while taking into account the many modalities' rich context. In terms of coherence, diversity, informativeness, relevance, and naturalness, AnyMail performed better than other AI models like ChatGPT, Llama 2, and GPT-4, although the quality of its training data might still be improved. It is a flexible paradigm with uses in many different fields, but responsible and ethical use is essential to prevent problems like false information and intellectual property violations. It combines these many signals into a single textual space using a sophisticated pre-trained aligner module taking advantage of the strong text reasoning capabilities of modern LLMs like Alama 2. AnyMail broadens the spectrum by seamlessly combining various modalities, in contrast to earlier models that combine text with a single extra modality. A harmonized comprehension of varied inputs is made possible by the model's design, which enables it to map outputs from each modality encoder into the joint LLM embedding space. With pre-training on large datasets including 200 million pictures, 2.2 million audio, 500 million IMU time series, and 28 million videos, all synced with the same LLM, AnyMail offers a scalable solution. The model is tuned across its three primary modalities of image, video, and audio, enabling a wide range of jobs outside the scope of traditional quality assurance. Benchmark tests confirm its strength, breaking previous records and showing considerable gains in performance across a range of multimodal tasks, the pre-training approach of AnyMail involves combining textual narratives and multimodal data. The space in which text tokens are embedded in the LLM changes into a shared space that may represent both text and other modalities. Scaling is made efficient by using quantization techniques, enabling training on strong GPUs without requiring a lot of resources. The improvement of AnyMail doesn't stop with pre-training. The multimodal instruction tuning dataset is used to perform additional fine-tuning on it. The manual annotation and synthetic augmentation of this dataset provide high-quality instruction response pairs across a range of modalities, making sure that the model's responses are deeply rooted in its comprehension of the provided multimodal context is the main focus. AnyMail's introduction highlights how AI is constantly improving as it attempts to integrate and make sense of many data sources. Currently, AnyMail gives a hopeful peek into a time when AI will be able to understand not only our speech, but also the world as seen through our eyes, hearing, and senses. It's a significant advancement in the development of multimodal language models.
not just another small step. Enabling robots to comprehend and produce human language in combination with diverse sensory inputs such as photos, videos, audio, and motion signals has been one of the core issues in artificial intelligence. Applications like accessibility, content creation, and human-computer interaction are all significantly impacted by this issue. Traditional language models frequently only consider text-based inputs and outputs, which restricts their capacity to understand and react to the variety of ways that people interact with their environment. A group of researchers have taken on this issue head-on after realizing this constraint, resulting in the creation of Enimal, a groundbreaking multimodal language model. When addressing various modalities, current language understanding techniques and tools frequently need to catch up. To overcome this obstacle, the Enimal research team has developed a fresh strategy. They have created a massive multimodal language model that smoothly incorporates different sensory inputs. Enimal is more than just a language model. It is a representation of AI's capacity to comprehend and produce language in a multimodal setting. Consider engaging with an AI model by mixing external sensory cues. By allowing inquiries that assume a common understanding of the world through sensory impressions, such as visual, oral, and motion cues, Enimal makes this possible. Enimal can process and generate language while taking into account the rich context offered by many modalities in contrast to typical language models that just use text. Both the methodology and the possible uses of Enimal are impressive. To train this multimodal language model, the researchers use scalable methods and open-sourced materials. The Multimodal Instruction Tuning Dataset, a painstakingly curated collection of annotations for multimodal instruction data, is one of the major contributions. To train Enimal, the researchers use scalable methods and open-source materials. Annotations for multimodal instruction data are included in the Multimodal Instruction Tuning Dataset, which is one of the major innovations. The ability of Enimal to comprehend and react to commands involving various sensory inputs was greatly improved by the training of this dataset. Even though Enimal represents a substantial advancement in multimodal language comprehension, it has some drawbacks. It occasionally has trouble prioritizing visual context over text-based cues, and the amount of available paired image text data equals the extent of its understanding. However, Enimal's ability to support several modalities throws up fascinating opportunities for further study and applications in AI-driven communication. Overall, Enimal is a revolutionary advancement in artificial intelligence that tackles the difficulty of fusing language comprehension with a variety of sensory inputs. Content creation and human-computer interaction present fascinating opportunities for future study and AI-driven communication applications. That's all for today. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive notifications. Also express your valuable thoughts in the comment section below. Until then, bye. Also spend some time watching other videos on the channel.